YouTube. I am not exactly video ready today, but I did want to come and show you what I picked up from the Bath and Body Works $8.50 candle sale. Um, I posted a picture on Instagram and originally I had the little cute pink plaid bag here, which is here. And I had seven candles in it. Um, the lady in the store was telling us about a chocolate and pistachio candle so we went to another bath and body works and i ended up getting four more candles or rather we went to the white barn attached to the bath and body works and i got four more candles so i wanted to show you what i picked up and i do not need to buy any more candles anytime soon but let me show you what i have here um excuse my hair this is like lazy Sunday meal prep, relax, watch Hallmark holiday videos day. But I did want to do this video. So the first one that I'm going to show you, I actually wrapped up because they didn't want to give me another one of those crates. And this one is warm apple pie. And I actually saw this one when I was standing in line and smelled it and had to have it and this one says baked granny smith apples melted brown sugar flaky homemade crust and it smells exactly like like the mrs smith's apple pie it smells exactly like that um the next one i picked up strictly because of the jar which i plan to reuse and this one is called Smoked Vanilla. And this was one of the 2650. Yeah, one of the 2650 candles. And I really, really like the jar that they put the candle in. Um, my husband actually went with me. So he went smelling candles with me. And he liked this one. I kind of liked it. I like it too. And you can actually really, really smell that smoked smell to it and the vanilla at the same time. It's kind of weird, but I like it. It says smoked Tahitian vanilla, sandalwood, leather, and Southern bourbon. So it's a manly smell pretty much. Maybe that's why he liked it. Uh, the next one that I have here is cinnamon caramel swirl, which is another one that my husband liked. And this one is Addictive Caramel Ground Cinnamon, Rich Brown Sugar, and Creamy Vanilla. And it smells really good. I actually 100% agreed with him on this one. Wasn't crazy about this packaging. I do like the decorative lid, but the smell is what made me pick that one up. Uh, this one, I think we have both been... Um, wanting to pick up anyway and i have this one in the body product and this one is winter candy apple and i think i also had it in um the hand soap one year too this is one that comes back every year and so this one is sort of a holiday favorite for me red apple candied orange maple leaf fresh cinnamon and winter rose petals and I am excited to see what a candle of the winter candy apple smells like. I have, I didn't think I picked this one up, but apparently I did. And I think it's because my husband liked it once again. This one is snowflake and citrus. And this one was pretty interesting. It, I kind of like the um, scent. It, it's not one, and my camera is not, okay. I guess good enough. Um, it's not one that I would have picked up on my own, but he picked it up and smelled it. And um, I kind of liked it. This one says frozen lemon peel and you can smell the lemon. Fresh, fresh squeezed tangerine, white. I am so reading this fundamental. Winter white mango and sugared snow crystals. I have absolutely no idea what a sugared snow crystal smells like. So maybe this is it. But I did like the smell of it. Um, 
the next one that I picked up is salted caramel and I like anything that smells like a dessert. This one has the snowflake on the top. This one says salted caramel, roasted chestnut, nuts, caramelized, caramelized sugar <coughs> and dark molasses. But this one smells really good. And yes, it does remind you of one of those drinks that you can pick up from the Starbucks. And maybe that's why I like it so much. But this is what the packaging looks like. And my camera is having such a hard time sort of focusing on what I want. There we go. Salted caramel. I really, really love the um, label on this one. And then the last one in the first bag is one that I got two of. This is my absolute favorite all-time winter scent from Bath and, Bo Bath and Body Works. And this is the Marshmallow Fireside. On the um, website, they had the Marshmallow Fireside with this label, but the actual glass was a frosted brown. I could not find that in the store anywhere and I couldn't leave Marshmallow Fireside in the um, store at all. So I got what they had. It says toasted marshmallow, smoldering woods, fire roasted vanilla and crystallized amber. And this is like my very, very favorite winter candle from Bath and Body Works. Um, for some reason, I like this where I don't like Fireside at all. Fireside actually does really just smell like wood, like wood burning. And I don't really like that one. But I do like the marshmallow. So, I just knocked the lid off of my warm apple pie. So, maybe that means I should burn that one. Um, from the White Barn store, I did actually pick up the chocolate is it chocolate? Chocolate pistachio. So that is what that looks like. It almost looks like a chocolate bar with um, like pistachios crumbled on it. But this smells so good. Like you can smell like the saltiness of like the pistachios and the chocolate at the same time. And for some reason, we only picked up one of these and I don't know why, but um, Probably because I was, in, <laughs> I was like tired of picking up candles. But um, chocolate and pistachio smells really, really good. Let me just see if they have it online. And I think the sale is over at this point. Oh, this one was on my list online. Like I almost totally forgot my list online by the time I got to the store. But this one was on it. And it is the Maple Cinnamon Pancakes. And it has that frosted um, jar like I was talking about with the marshmallow fireside. But this is the cute festive packaging for this one. This one says warm maple syrup, fluffy buttermilk pancakes, and fresh ground cinnamon. I am super excited. Like I almost want to burn this one in the kitchen. It smells so good like it, it really deserves to be burned in the kitchen so and we only got one of these and yeah they had a few and i only got one i think i because i wanted to like try different things so i got a bunch of different candles um i got another one of my fall favorites because i was still shocked that they had it in the store and this is sort of another sort of breakfast scent but this is the pumpkin pecan waffles this is one of my absolute favorite um, fall scents from Bath and Body Works. So you can see it still, it has the pumpkin on the top of it. And oh my God, when this thing first came out, I was like very addicted to it. I was like crossing my fingers that it wasn't one of those ones that would just um, be for like one season. They wouldn't ever bring it back. And I don't know why I'm not in focus. This is irritating to me. There we go. Um... It says maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice, and brown sugar. So I'm almost like I should burn this one in like the dining room and put that pancake one in the kitchen and have the whole floor just smelling like breakfast. And then the last one I have here is just my second um, marshmallow fireside. So that is it. That is what I picked up. I picked up a total of 11 candles. 
Of course, I went in there armed with my coupons as well. So that knocked the price of the candles down to um, I think $7.11 a piece. Um, I know some people had like better candles, I mean better coupons than I did, but I don't mind at all. I think I did pretty well for buying 11 candles. And I wanted to share my little stash with you all. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you were able to um, get in on that sale because it's only once a year. The next time I'm going to go looking for some of these candles, especially like the holiday ones, is like, like the day after Christmas when they start the semi-annual sale to see what I can pick up then. But I actually think I am pretty covered for the winter. So that's it. I'm glad I could get in on that sale. Thank you all so much for watching and have a good day. Bye.